For the patients that they're realistically, they want a more natural look, but they're not looking for just enlargement, just the size and the enhancement. The other alternative is fat grafting. And the process involves the harvesting the fat from different parts of the body and processing it and injecting into the breast tissue for enlargement. The typical enlargement with the fat grafting is about one cup maximum being larger. The patient wants to go larger and they want to have a more cleavage, more softer envelope over the implant. What offered them is that combination of using the implant for size and then fat grafting for the cleavage and also build up the soft tissue to cover the implant. So when you're touching the breast, you don't feel the implant. You feel the own breast tissue and then use the implant as a projection and give the larger size. But the fat grafting by itself, recovery is typically between three to five days and is mainly from the donor side. The typical breast doesn't have that much pain because you don't cut any muscle, there's a small incision for injection, and mainly the patient has some discomfort from the donor side, from the air the fat taken out, and all depends on the patient. Some patients, they have a specific part of the body that they want to uh, donate the fat, from the abdomen, from the low handle, and those areas usually heal very well. For the patients that they have less amount of fat, then you have to go from knee for inner thigh and inner thigh, usually the cover is a bit longer.